Tonight, our reporter Brian Ross has found that the familiar organized mob, or mafia, now has some competition, particularly in the business of smuggling and selling hard drugs. Competitors who use their own methods to bring their merchandise into this country. The North Carolina mob is run by men who know a lot about the military. Ten of the top men in this organization are former sergeants in the Army or the Air Force. Federal authorities identify this man as the head of the North Carolina mob. Leslie Ike Atkinson, Goldsboro, North Carolina, former Master Sergeant, United States Army. Martin Perry directed the federal government's investigation of the North Carolina mob. Perry says law enforcement officials were slow to acknowledge the importance of this new mob because its leaders are black, not mafia members. To start working on these upstarts, on these new people, wasn't interesting because you got the most points for working on a good mafia guy uh, who had been memorialized as a bad guy from way back. Is this network of black, non-commissioned military officers still active today? Oh yes, I would say so. This is black organized crime? Yes, yes. In a nutshell, that's exactly what it is. There have always been blacks in organized crime operations, but never at the top. This new mob has already staked out much of the heroin business for itself. And authorities say it is beginning to use its well-disciplined organization to compete with the mafia in other areas of criminal activity. The North Carolina mob is this country's newest organized crime family.